Hi guys. Ah, Jim Bales with Caught Motor Works and Motorhome Rehab Ranch on Patreon. And thank you for uh, giving me a few minutes and uh, glad to see you ranch hands. So the last several weeks, I've been doing a lot of explaining on the phone about what Motorhome Rehab Ranch is. It's kind of a goofy name. I know it's a little long. And why in the heck would you want to be a ranch hand? I mean, it sounds silly, but here's what happened. Since COVID, we have been so inundated, is the word, with work. We're essentially, you've heard the term, you have so much work, you're out of business. It's about it. We have so much work here that, pe that people want us to do. We're essentially, we're so far out that we can't do any work for you guys. It's terrible. It's a terrible thing. But it's a wonderful thing because the GMC is being rediscovered. Okay? And that's where we want to be. We made a good choice by having these things. But without us having the ability to do any work, Currently, we're not doing any paint work. We're also not doing any interior work other than dashes, uh, uh, wiring harnesses, air conditioner in the dash. So the rest of the coach, we're so buried with just doing the mechanical upfits that we can't do anything else. So what do we do? We want to try to support the community. We want to support you guys. That's where Motorhome Rehab Ranch came in, okay? I'm in the loop of more of you guys working on your coach than I ever have. I've got two motors being built right now out. I've got machinists. If you need a motor, we don't sell motors anymore. But if you go out with a motor and you need one, let's find a machinist near you. Let's find a builder and put me in their loop. Let me help them understand how to build motors the way we do. I'm not going to tell them their business. You know, a mechanic has three things going for themselves. They got their tools, got their knowledge, and their tattoos. <laughs> you don't mess with any of those. You tell them I won't. But I've been doing this for so long that I can help you guys with whatever you're doing. For paint work, I can work with your painter and tell him the little things that he would learn after he did it the first time. But you only have one motorhome. If you're working on interior work, that's what these videos are for, is to give you the information to be able to, for you to understand what it's about so you can make better decisions. I tell people, look, we no longer provide fish. We don't sell fish. We don't, shell, we don't send parts. But through Motorhome Rehab Ranch, I can tell you where the lake is I can show you how to fish, and I'll be over at the bait shop if you need anything. Look at it that way, okay? There's so much happening with GMCs. I'm working on more now than I ever have, like I said. And uh, I think it seems like being a ranch hand, quote unquote, you can call me anytime. You don't have to say, oh, Jim, I'm sorry to bother you. I'm in your loop. It's five dollars a month. I'd do it even if you didn't pay. It doesn't matter because what I'm trying to do is help the community. Okay? If you have a quick question, call me. If I'm making a difference, if I'm helping you with your coach and I'm helping you with what parts to find, how to do things, if I give it away and you give it back to me, that's mine. There's a legitimate income derived from helping people. And that's what we're trying to do here with these GMCs. And it's working. It's working. Uh, our business is, like I said, it's, it's stronger than it ever has. Reshaping our business, we're more effective and efficient than we ever have. And I'm able to help you guys at home more than I ever have. So all of these things are good. It was, it was a tough thing to get this thing going, back going. You know, whenever you stop pushing a rock and you start to push it again, you know, it's heavy. Well, we're trying to find a way to push it around the hill. <laughs> we're trying to come up with a new idea and it's working. It's working real well. You guys are helping 
and uh, I really appreciate that. If you want to talk more about this, if you, uh, if you want to get me in your loop, go to the website, uh, Motorhome Rehab Ranch. Well, go to Patreon. People say, well, what's Patreon? P-A-T-R-E-O-N. Kind of a weird word. It's supposed to be like patrons. Patrons following a painter or whatever. And if you appreciate that, then some Patreon sites are locked away, where if you don't pay, you don't say, you don't play. Uh, our site is a free video database. There's over 120 videos there now. So, you know, you can binge watch popcorn. Um, but that's what this is about. These motorhomes are coming back. They never did leave. And you and I may leave this earth, but these motorhomes are staying. Yes, sir, baby. So that's why we want to pay attention to them. That's why we're paying all this time and all this energy to put all this together for you to help the community. All right. Uh, thank you for your uh, your suggestions on videos. Uh, we've been, I think, pretty timely on things. Um, we we certainly helped a lot of people. They appreciate it, and that's what we want to do. All right. So suggestions. You're going to work on this bolt. You know, you say, well, what can be a big deal about a a, a bumper bolt? Well, this is a solid stainless steel bumper bolt. Why? You've seen the rust coming down when the bumper bolt starts to rust. A bumper bolt is a steel bolt with a stainless steel cap on it. But the metal underneath still rusts. If you don't use a solid stainless steel bolt, you'll have a rust stain and it'll take out the, uh, the uh, chrome. So even on something as small as this, you might need to get some input. That's what we're here to do. Not just talk about bumper bolts. All of it. All right. Well, look, thank you for your time. Thanks for all the people that have joined and the people that I've enjoyed uh, working with your coach, and we're doing more now. Uh, and if you want to get one of these, you want to learn about them, you want me to help you with it, like I said in a lot of the uh, beginnings of our videos, you're in the right place. That's what we do. So good. Hopefully I got that straightened out. In the future, if somebody asks me about it, I'm going to tell them to go to this video. And if you have anybody else asking, what the heck is this all that mess about? Send them to this video. If you think it's silly, that's fine. Go somewhere else. If you appreciate what I'm doing, I'm supporting you. I'm asking you to support me. All right. Enough of that mess. Thanks. We'll see you next time. We'll give you something to, to think about. Bye-bye.